Super Cassettes Industries Private Limited, doing business as T Series, is an Indian music record label and film production company founded by Gulshan Kumar in 1983. It is primarily known for Bollywood music soundtracks and indie pop music. As of 2017, T Series is one of the largest Indian music record labels, along with Z Music and Sony Music India. Kumar, initially a fruit juice seller in Delhi, founded T Series as a company to sell pirated Bollywood songs, before they eventually began producing new music. Their breakthrough came with the soundtrack for the 1988 Bollywood blockbuster Kayamit Se Kayamit Talk, composed by Anand Milan, written by Majru Sultanpuri, and starring Amir Khan and Juhi Chawla, which became one of the best-selling Indian music albums of the 1980s, with over 8 million sales. They eventually became a leading music label with the release of Ashiki 1990, composed by Nadeem Shravan, which sold 20 million copies and became the best-selling Indian soundtrack album of all time. However, Gulshan Kumar was murdered by the Mumbai Mafia Syndicate D Company in 1997. Since then, T-Series has been led by his son Bhushan Kumar and younger brother Krishan Kumar. T-Series YouTube channels are run by a team of 13 people at the T-Series headquarters. The company's main YouTube channel primarily shows music videos and occasionally film trailers. In January 2017, it became the most viewed YouTube channel, with over 56 billion views as of 19 December 2018. With over 77 million subscribers as of 30 December 2018, it also ranks as the second most subscribed channel behind PewDiePie. In addition, T-Series has a multi-channel network, with 29 channels that have more than 100 million YouTube subscribers as of November 2018 and 61.5 billion views as of August 2018. Topic: History T-Series was founded on July 11, 1983, by Gulshan Kumar, at the time an obscure fruit juice seller in the Daryagunj neighborhood of Delhi. The company initially sold pirated Bollywood songs. Prior to releasing original music, Kumar discovered that there was a market for devotional music, and began recording and selling them. Kumar noticed that many elderly Hindu followers could not read the hymns and chants because of failing eyesight, so Kumar hired singers to record the chants and sold them as cheap cassettes. Later, he filmed major Hindu pilgrimages in India and sold them on VHS and video cassette tapes. T Series' first original film soundtrack release was for Lalu Ram in 1984, with music scored by Ravindra Jain. The company's breakthrough came when it released the soundtrack for the 1988 Bollywood blockbuster Kayamit Se Kayamit Talk, also known as QSQT, directed by Mansoor Khan and starring Amir Khan and Juhi Chawla. The Kayamit Se Kayamit Talk soundtrack, composed by Anand Miland and written by Majru Sultanpuri, became the best-selling Indian soundtrack album of 1988 and one of the best-selling Indian soundtrack albums of the 1980s, with more than 8 million units sold. The biggest hit song from the album was, Papa Ket Hain sung by Udit Narayan and picturized on Amir Khan. 
T-Series founder Gulshan Kumar soon played a key role in Bollywood's cassette boom of the late 1980s with his affordable T-Series albums. T-Series later became a leading music label with the release of Ashiki 1990, a film soundtrack album composed by duo Nadeem Shrubin, which sold 20 million units in India, and is the best-selling Bollywood soundtrack album of all time. A cover version of Dear Dear from Ashiki was later sung by Yo Yo Honey Singh and released by T Series in 2015. T Series was largely responsible for sparking a boom for the Indian music industry in the early 1990s. Many of the best selling Bollywood music albums of the 1990s, particularly those composed by Nadeem Shrubin, were released under the T Series label. Besides music production, the company also began venturing into film production. The annual earnings of T Series grew from 200 million rupees, 16 million dollars in 1985 to 2 billion rupees, 88 million dollars in 1991 and by 1997 had reached 5 billion rupees, 140 million dollars in 1997. T Series founder Gulshan Kumar was murdered by the Mumbai Mafia Syndicate D Company. His assassination also led to T Series losing its most prolific musicians at the time, Nadeem Shrubin, due to Nadeem actor Safi initially being accused of involvement in the murder, before later being exonerated. After Gulshan Kumar's death in 1997, the company has since been led by his son Bhushan Kumar, with the help of Gulshan's younger brother Krishan Kumar. As a film production company, the highest grossing T series film production to date is the critically acclaimed sleeper hit Hindi Medium 2017, written by Zenat Lakhani, directed by Saket Chaudhry, and starring Irfan Khan and Saba Kumar. It grossed 3.224 billion rupees, 50 million dollars worldwide, with 34 million dollars in China alone, becoming one of the top 20 highest grossing Indian films of all time. T series and one of the most expensive Indian films will be Saho, a sci-fi thriller with a production budget of 3 billion rupees, 42 million dollars, scheduled for release in 2019. T series is also producing a biopic film based on the life of its founder Gulshan Kumar, called Mogul, which is currently under production and is scheduled for release in 2019. Topic: <laughs> YouTube presence. T-Series joined YouTube on 13 March 2006, but only started uploading videos in late 2010. Under this channel, T-Series primarily shows music videos and film trailers. By July 2013, it had crossed 1 billion views, becoming the second Indian YouTube channel to cross the milestone after Rajshri Productions. In January 2017, T-Series surpassed PewDiePie to become the world's most viewed YouTube channel, and as of 19 December 2018 it has 56 billion views. The T Series YouTube channel is run by a team of 13 people at the T Series headquarters. The YouTube channel has reached 75 million subscribers, making it the second most subscribed YouTube channel after PewDiePie. Currently, it is the most subscribed Asian and non English language YouTube channel. 
Reaching 50 million subscribers, the channel received a custom play button on September 10, 2018. It is also the second channel ever to hit 70 million subscribers. Beyond this, the channel earns an average of nearly 150,000 subscribers a day. T Series Channel also owns a multi channel network, with 29 channels, which include YouTube channels such as T Series Tamil, T Series Telugu, and Bollywood Classics. On top of this, six of their channels are among the top 100 most subscribed channels in India, including T-Series, Bhakti Sagar, APNA Punjab, T-Series Regional, Lahari Music, and T-Series Telugu. T-Series 29 channels have accumulated a total of more than 100 million YouTube subscribers as of November 2018, and 61.5 billion views as of August 2018. During January to July 2018, T-Series earned an income of 7.2 billion rupees $100 million from YouTube. The most popular T-Series artist on YouTube is Guru Randawa, whose 2017 song, Lahore, has crossed 700 million views on YouTube. The growth of T-Series YouTube channel has been attributed to India's emerging online population. India currently has 500 million internet users and this number is expected to grow rapidly. A major breakthrough in India's internet growth came in September 2016 with India's first 4G network, Reliance Geo, offering data at very low costs. India has since emerged as the world's second largest online population behind China, where YouTube is blocked, with YouTube alone having over 225 million monthly Indian users. India's high demand for YouTube content and the lack of local content creators has contributed significantly to the rapid growth of T Series. The growth of T Series is also attributed to its growing audience outside of India. About 40% of the channel's traffic comes from outside of India, including 12% from the United States. The majority of the channel's overseas viewers belong to the global South Asian diaspora. More recently, the channel's overseas viewership has increased further, as a result of attention and controversy drawn to the channel by foreign YouTubers such as PewDiePie and MR Beast. YouTubers such as MR Beast and Justin Roberts made videos which were in support of PewDiePie to keep him as the most subscribed channel on YouTube. Topic: <laughs> Legal In November 2007, T-Series filed a lawsuit against YouTube for infringing on the copyright of its music by allowing users to upload videos of its music onto YouTube, which could be accessed for free and obtained an interim order against YouTube from the Delhi High Court, which restrained YouTube from infringing on its copyright. T-Series and YouTube settled out of court in January 2011. <laughs> List of artists The following musical artists have had music currently or previously released under the T-Series label A. R. Rahman Abhijit Bhattacharya, Alka Yagnik, Anand Milan, Anand Shrivastav and Milan Shrivastav, Anuradha Padwal, Anwar, Asha Bosli, Bibul Supriyo, Kumar Sanu, 
Guru Randawa Himesh Reshamiya Jasmine Walia Javed Actor Lucky Ali MIA Nadeem Shravan, Nadeem actor Safi and Shravan Kumar Rathod. Nikhil Vinay, Nikhil Kamath and Vinay Tiwari. Nitin Mukesh. Pankaj Udis. Purnima. Rihat Fateh Ali Khan. Rajesh Roshan. Raju Singh. Samir. Sawin Kumar Tak Sajid Wajid Sajid Khan and Wajid Khan Sandeep Chota San Shreya Ghoshal Sonu Nigam Sophie Chowdhury Sukhwinder Singh Suniti Chohan Talat Aziz Tanvi Shah Udit Narayan Vishal Shikar Vishal Dadlani and Shikar Ravjani Yo Yo Honey Singh Zach Knight Topic Production Filmography Topic 1990s Topic 2000s Topic 2010s Topic Soundtrack discography This is a list of soundtrack albums that were published under the T-Series label, excluding films that were also produced by T-Series see production filmography above. Bollywood Topic Tamil T Series collaborated with Lahari Music. Topic International Equals Equals Notes <laughs>